I remember when I was a kid, I used to have to do some chores. I had to sweep the floor, had to make up my bed, I had to pull the weeds. And I remember one chore, I had to take out the trash. Sometimes I pouted. I don't want to take out the trash. Funny thing, <laughs> I'm all grown up now, and I still have to take out the trash. You should be a caterpillar. Oh, hey, Hermie. Oh, yeah? Why is that? No garbage. We eat everything we see. Hmm. I can see your point. So, Hermie, were you well behaved as a child? Oh, absolutely. I obeyed my mom and my dad, and even listened to others like my teachers and, and Granny Pillar. I always did what they asked me to do. Hermie, are you up there? Oh, quick, hide me. Granny Pillar wants me to do some chores. But you said you always did what she asked you to do. But if she doesn't find me, she can't ask me. Then I don't have to do any chores. That way I'm not disobeying her. But that's not good behavior. When your mom or dad or even your granny pillar ask you to do something, you show them respect by listening. You're right again, Max. Well, here goes. I'm up here, granny pillar. Oh, good. Would you like to help me? Here it comes. Eat some of these delicious peach dumplings I made. I think I have too many. Boy, yes, ma'am. Uh, I'll be right there. Gotta go, Max, like you said. I need to help my granny pillar. <laughs> Bye. Right, but, but hold on, don't start without me now. I don't want you to pull a muscle or something. You see, good behavior is how we act toward others. Our manners, our attitude, our heart. And as Busby's about to find out, teaching his niece and nephew good behavior is not that easy. Hey, Hermie, you need any help with those dumplings? No, my God. Well, I got it. Now, uh, <clears throat> thanks, though. Just trying to help. Oh, don't worry. I'll make sure that there's no trash to take out. Great party, Busby. Well, thank you, well, thank you very much. It's my anniversary of when I started following the rules. R-U-L-E-S, rules. Yeah, I remember when I started following the rules. It was like it was yesterday. It was yesterday. Yeah, uh, no, no, it wasn't. It was longer than that. It's been at least a week now. It looks like everyone's having a good time, especially the ants. Thanks for buzzing. This is Busby. Hey, Barbie. This is my sister, Barbie. You want to know if I could watch your kids? Sure. When? Tonight? Well, I'm having a small party. Well, where are you? Hello, 
BB. Hello, buddy. How you guys been? B E E N Ben. Why don't you spell a word for your Uncle Busby? Please! Spelling is so not cool. Not cool? Since when? Spelling has always been cool. C O O. Whatever. L. Cool. Oh, these are my good friends, Hermie and Wormy. This is... Do <sighs> you have anything to eat in this dump? We're hungry. Nice to, uh, be ignored by you. And maybe something to drink? Hey, buddy! Dear Busby, Thank you for watching B.B. and Buddy this weekend. Barney and I need a break. B-R-E-A-K, break. Make sure the kids behave, pick up after themselves, help around the hive, go to bed early, and mind their Uncle Busby. <laughs> Love your sis, Barbie. Um, hello! We're starving here! Oh, I'm happy to show you to the food, but your mama said you need to pick up after yourselves. Why don't you pick up your bags? I just got here, and already I'm your slave. Quick, quick, quick! I'm just a worker bee to you. What about me? What about my needs? We would never get away with that. Uh-uh. Busby, looks like you have a couple of grumble bees on your hands. I think you're right. Hey, hey, stop crying. Oh, okay, you don't have to pick up. I'll do it for you. It's right here. Come and get it. All the way over there? Okay. Okay, let's move it. This isn't a roach motel. Buzz off. Well, I never. Actually, you did that once. Oh, right. <laughs> <laughs> honey soup? We hate honey soup! Why do we always have to have honey soup? I want honey candy! Uh, and honey ice cream! And honey chocolate chip cookies! Oh, come on yeah, now. I honey is honey, and all bees love honey. Please try the soup. We'll get some dessert later. <sighs> Baby, please sit up. Take your feet off the table and no reading while you eat. Buddy, no elbows on the table and no slurping, please. <laughs> oh, boy. Uh-oh. Why do we always have to eat the way other bees eat? It's none of your beeswax how I eat. I can't wait until I grow up and move to my own hive. And I can eat my way. I guess if you don't like it, you can go to bed. So early? This is crazy! Why does everyone treat us like we're baby bees? Why do we have to go to bed so early? Dumb old rules. R-O-O-L-S. Rules. She... She misspelled. Now listen, and listen good. While you're staying here, this is my beehive. And you two have to behave in my beehive. You gotta behave in the beehive. You gotta behave in a beehive. You gotta behave in my beehive. You gotta behave in any beehive. It ain't no joke. It ain't no job. You gotta behave in a beehive. Gotta clean your room and pick up your toys You can't go crazy making all kinds of noise Hang up your clothes, keep them off the floor You'll have more fun once you're done with your chores You gotta behave in the beehive Behave in a beehive You gotta behave in my beehive You gotta behave in a any beehive It ain't no joke, it ain't no job You gotta behave in the beehive 
have. Please don't talk with your mouth full of food, and mind your manners and never be rude. Listen to your grown ups, cause they know what is best when they say go to bed, cause you need some good rest. Behave and be high, you gotta behave and be high, you gotta behave and my behave, you gotta behave and I ain't a behave. Well, ain't no joke, it ain't no job, you gotta be behave and be high. Behave and be high, behave and be high, you gotta behave and my behave, you gotta behave and I ain't a behave. It ain't no joke, it ain't no jive, you gotta be behave and be behave. It ain't no joke, it ain't no jive, you gotta be behave and be behave. Oh, baby, you gotta behave and be behave, man. Oh, yeah! Thank you, man. So, what do you think of that? Well, I'd like it better if things went the way I want them to go! How would you feel if everyone in the world acted the way you do? Then the world would be an unbelievable place! Dear God, you've got to help me. These kids are tough. T-O-U-G-H, tough. What am I going to do with them? Kids don't always practice good behavior. Good behavior is showing that you love others as you love yourself. It's about following the rules, minding your parents, and having good manners. They have to be taught the right way to behave. Rules show children the right way to act. Thank you, God. I bet they thought they wouldn't have to behave in my beehive. Let's follow God's advice and teach them about following the rules. Listen up, Busby's got a plan. P-L-A-N, plan. Uh, uh. Was that the plan? No, that's not the plan. This is the plan. Oh, that's good, uh-huh, yeah. Couldn't have done better myself. <laughs> well, I would have changed that part and, uh, and that. The rest of it's very good, though. Oh, this place isn't any fun. All those rules were good behavior. I have to go to bed early. Chores, table manners. Oh, oh. Nobody's gonna tell me how to behave. What do you think the world would be like if everyone acted like you? Acted, acted like, like you. you. Acted, acted like, like you. you. Hello? Hello? Echo. E-C-H-O. Echo. Hello? Hello? We're awake. And we're hungry. Don't you guys know we have to feed growing children? Where's our breakfast? Well, that's what we want to know. Hey, where's our breakfast? Yeah, I'm hungry. But you're supposed to make our breakfast. Why do we always have to make Why breakfast? Why can't someone else make breakfast for us? I don't like to make food. Feed me. Okay, okay, calm down. Don't be such babies. <laughs> Okay, so, uh, what are we gonna do today? Why do we always have to plan what to do today? Plan, plan, plan. We always have to plan we never get to do. I plan to do what I want to do. Okay, it's no big deal. Cut it out. We're out of here. That was weird. I've never seen them act that way. They're so immature, for sure. Hey, guys. What's the matter? We've been staying at Uncle Busby's hive. He thinks he's so cool with all his rules. Elbows off the table. Sit up straight. Pick up your stuff. It's horrible. Hey, why don't you come to our house? We got rid of our rules. <gasps> no rules? No rules. <laughs> that rules. 
How did you get your parents to stop giving you rules? We did this. Aww, what is that? We're sick of rules. <laughs> we never get our way. Everybody's so mean. <laughs> gimme, gimme, gimme. Mm. Well done. Very well done. Thank you. We've been working on our routine for a long time. <laughs> You have to let us borrow some of your moves. Oh, we'd be honored. Wow, this place is great. A house with no rules. A dream come true. Oh, oh. uh, we tripped over those shoes. Oh, yeah. We don't clean up after ourselves. Oh, uh, I see. Cool. Woo! Ooh. Ow! We like a messy house. Messy houses rule! Yeah, yeah, they rule. Uh, hey, we haven't eaten all day. Uh, what do you have to eat? I'll help yourself. We eat whatever we want. Cool. Hard part's finding a clean dish. Ew, gross! Don't you clean up anything around here? We don't do any chores. Never, ever, never. Yeah, that sounds really cool. But, um, it gets dangerous with all this junk laying around. You could get hurt. Yeah, but at least we don't have to do any work. Hi, three! Um, we need to go. Go? But we were just about to have a lead by. Run! Hey, come back. Hi, <laughs> You're it. What's going on around here? Those ladybugs were out of control. How do bugs live like that? You could get hurt. I'm sure hungry. We haven't eaten all day. I wish Uncle Busby had fed us. Why do I always have to find something Why to doesn't eat? anyone make food for I us? I don't like to make food. Feed me. Hey, you guys hungry? We're about to enjoy a nice picnic. You want to join us? Picnic? Food? You bet! <laughs> I can't wait! I'm so hungry I could eat... Oh, never mind. This is so good. Try it. Very delicious. Le crud, le crud. Is this the way you always eat? Don't you have any manners? Manners? If it's one thing we've learned at mealtime, it's that manners only slow you down. Then your gravy will get cold. Speaking of gravy, you have some on your shirt. Allow me. Help yourself. Mmm, nice and warm. We need to go. You can't go yet. We're about to eat dessert. You want some green stuff? That doesn't look right. Should be okay. It only expired a week ago. A week ago? That's nothing. Now, a month ago, that's too much. That's bad taste to eat something a month after the expiration date. I completely agree. <laughs> okay, that was disgusting. Those two cockroaches don't have any manners. <sighs> this whole place has gone crazy. Maybe we should get back to Busby's hive. Hey, how come everybody has to go to my hive? Why don't bugs ever go to their own hive? Well, no more crashing at my hive. Those three are really freaking me out. You hear that? Our stomachs are...
are screaming, Feed me! We have to find something to eat. I don't know, but I've been told. I don't know, but I've been told. Partying all night never gets old. Partying all night never gets old. What have we here? We're very hungry, and we're trying to get home to get something to eat. Come on, soldiers. We found the mother of all cakes, and we are going to partay. An all-nighter, baby. All night? We love to stay up all night. All out. Let's get this party started. Um, word up. Time is it? <laughs> it's time to rumba. <sighs> Don't you guys have an enemy sleep? Sleep? Sleep is for the weak. Don't be a bed bug. Dance, soldiers. Dance like there's no tomorrow. <laughs> oh, well, sorry. fun after all. I don't think I could stand a place where everybody has bad behavior all the time. <sighs> I wish this was all a dream so we could just wake up and start over again. <sighs> oh. Oh. We'll just sleep for a second and then it'll all be better. It'll all be better. It'll all be better. Come on, let's get them home, boys. H-O-M-E, home. There's no place like Hive. There's no place like Hive. Buddy, wake up! We're home! We're home! Oh! oh. What was wrong? nightmare. I, I dreamt that everyone in town had bad behavior. And and you were there, Uncle Busby. And, and you, Hermie. And Wormy. Oh. And, and you. And you. And you. And you were there. And, and you, too. And you. Who are you? You weren't there. <sighs> I'm never in anyone's dreams. Everyone there disobeyed. Nobody did any chores or cleaned up their messes, and everyone had bad table manners, and they stayed up all night. Not cleaning up? That sounds awful. No manners? Who would do such a thing? Not up all night. That's strictly against regulations. I know. It had to be a dream. Baby, what did you learn? L-E-A-R-N, learn. Uh, but I learned that if everyone had bad behavior like us, then the garden would be an awful place. We need to have good behavior and treat each other with respect. Right, buddy? Right? Buddy? Hey, we have chores to do. We'll start by getting breakfast ready. Come on, buddy. This is nice. N-I-C-E, nice. You guys picked up your stuff, you cleaned up the living room, and made us breakfast, all with a smile. Thank you. Thank you for all you've done for us. Uh, Hermie, your elbow. Huh? Oh, yeah, uh, just testing you. Thank you. Hey, you kids have been good bees. Why don't you go on outside and play? We'll clean up.
Your mom and dad just called. They'll be here in just a minute. But we don't want to go. We were just having fun. Uncle Busby, I'm so glad we came. I learned that having good behavior is really the best way to behave. Thanks. T-H-A-N-K-S. Thanks. Thanks. I had a great time. T-I-M-E time. Bye. Bye. So long. Bye. Thanks for coming. Nice meeting you. Be careful. Be safe. Have a good trip. Okay, careful now. Behave. Hey, be cool. C-O-O-L. Cool. That is... My stomach hurts. Maybe those expiration dates should have been taken a little more seriously. Oh, our mom is about to get home. We better get home and clean everything up. Thank you. Thank you very much for helping me teach my niece and nephew about good behavior. I hope it wasn't too much trouble for y'all. And God, please watch over BB and Buddy. I hope they continue to show good behavior to their parents and everyone to meet. Busby, it's up to them to obey, but you all showed them that good behavior is truly the best way. Thank you. Yeah, I'm glad they learned their lesson, but uh, hopefully we won't have to do that again. My arm hurts from all that pouting. Hi, Uncle Hermie. It's me, your nephew, Carson. My mom says I need to live with you for the summer. Hey, what do you have to eat around here? I'm hungry and bored already. What are we going to do? Oh, boy. Here we go again. You know, good behavior happens when we follow the rules in our house, our school or our church and the reason we follow the rules is because we love and respect and honor those who are giving the rules god shows us the best way to live through his commandments and if we love him we'll only follow his commandments that's why jesus said that the greatest commandment is to love the lord your god with all of your heart and soul and mind and strength and if we begin right there, we'll always do what is right. Well, I showed good behavior by helping Granny Pillar finish off those peach dumplings. I guess that counts. Boy, you get the easy jobs. What do you mean? Look at the chores I have to do. Clean the gutters, paint the house, unclog the toilet, brush the grout, balance the tires. It's my wife's honeydew list. Honeydew list. Whoa, boy, that sounds delicious. Um, do you have a cantaloupe list or, or a watermelon list, too? No, it's a honeydew this or a honeydew that list. Well, they should change that name. It's a bit misleading. Yeah, totally. Oh, Max. <gasps> it's my wife, Dina. Hide me. Max? Yeah, you're right. Good behavior. <clears throat> Yes, dear. I have one other thing for you to do. Here it comes. Could you help me finish off this raspberry pie? Sure. I'll be right there. Hey, I got to go. I don't want to disappoint her. Coming. Be right there. Here I come. Hey, uh, you need any help? No. 